looks like my camera died on me. <laughs> but after you wash your face with soap and water, and you scrub a little bit, exfoliate. Then you want to put a moisturizer, which I put the Nivea cream. Somewhere around here. And now I'm just working my face with the jade roller. In any place that you feel any tension, you can't, you want to press on that just a little bit harder. Now the jaw back here, I'm not surprised because when we stress, what happens? We clench our teeth or we hold our breath. So this right here is gonna be sore. So massage that even behind the ears because behind the ears, again, those muscles that are behind your jaw, the same ones that are connected to your ear, to your neck and everything else. And if you don't massage it and if you don't work with the issues then you're gonna have more diseases, or as I like to call it, disharmony <clears throat> within the body because everything should be in harmony because we're frequency. And if we're not, then we got work to do. Not all the time are we going to be in harmony, um, but you can do your best to try to stay balanced. Find your own balance and harmony because that's different for everyone. <sighs> So just breathing in through your nose and out through your mouth. Start with the forehead. Alright, and then work your way down to the sides. Yeah, that's a little sore to it. Uh, that bone. to the back of the neck too. And then I like to go to the T zone. And then under the eyeballs. <sighs> And one of the really awesome things about being a Reiki teacher, a practitioner of Reiki, is we can use Reiki with everything. I mean, me doing this right now, I'm using Reiki. So what I did was I just did Chokurei, Chokurei symbol, on my jade roller, okay? So after I do Chokure simple. I say Reiki on and bam! Zzz, I feel the Reiki. <laughs> um, what I feel from the... My dryer. What I feel from the Reiki is I feel a little bit of tingling on the face. There's a little bit of tingling. Um, and I feel movement. Not just in my face, but in my body. So you can hear me taking these deep breaths. It's because I'm releasing. So every deep breath that I take in, I'm bringing in positive energy and positive vibrations and I'm releasing lower vibrations that I don't need right now. Lower vibrations that I do not need right now or that do not serve my highest good. So that's one thing that you'll realize too when you're doing intention work and you're doing energy work that what you put out there and the, the words and the spells that you put out there, because words are spell casting, um, you have to be very specific with it. <clears throat> For example, if you want money to flow through you, that's awesome. Who doesn't want money to flow through them? But do you want that money to flow through you to where you can't even hang on to it? You know, it's going to be flowing through you so fast. Are you going to be able to save? Are you going to be able to invest it? You know what I mean? Um, so when you say money flows through me, you can say I'm a magnet to money, you know, or 
instead of trying to pinpoint certain specific things with Reiki, because as humans, that's how we limit ourselves. We try to control the Reiki. Um, you limit. So instead of saying, I have money flow through me, you can say, I live in abundance, you know. So when you're setting your day up and you're saying, I'm going to have a good day, start to imagine what that day is going to look like. You know, even if you don't know what it's going to look like, picture it being a good day. Imagine yourself smiling, you know. <sighs> so, see if the jade roller with your intention works when you wake up in the morning. Because, again, what, it was about five, seven minutes. My other video I had to put together because my thing died. But it doesn't take a long time. It doesn't take you um, having to carve out a large portion of your day just to do this. It doesn't. How bad do you want to set your day up to have a good day? Um, but tell me how it works out for you guys. Um, tell me if you use something else. Tell me if you do a different morning routine. I know it may be different for guys. Um, you know, so if you have a morning routine, like maybe drinking your coffee, which I will be doing more of that. Tell me what you do when you're drinking your coffee. Do you read? Do you jump on the phone right away? Or do you work on other things? Um, so let me know what you do. I'm just going to finish getting ready to go to the gym so I can knock out my workout. And um, yeah, let me know what you guys do. And if there's something else that works for you, tell me. Okay? Bye, guys. Have a good one. And you'll probably be seeing more videos from me.